in this question we need to prove that for the cost function we are being given cost function c is equal to 100 plus x plus 2x square where x denotes the output the slope of our average cost curve is equal to 1 upon x into marginal cost minus average cost we need to prove that very relationship okay so what is our cost function cost function is being given us as 100 uh, plus x uh, plus 2x square okay this is our cost function now what is average cost average cost is simply that cost upon x that is total cost upon the output gives us the average cost so if we divide this it will come out to be 100 upon x dividing each uh, term uh, with x okay plus x upon x plus 2x square upon x okay so here we have 100 upon x uh, plus 1 uh, plus 2x okay this is our uh, average cost okay now what is slope of average cost uh, slope of ac means we need to take the derivative of the average cost with respect to x okay so if this is our cost of, uh, if we take uh, the derivative uh, this will give us the slope okay and slope is given by d a c upon dx that means taking derivative of average cost with respect to x gives us the slope okay so let me rub this out here so let us see what is the derivative of x here so we have actually 1 upon x what is the derivative of 1 upon x if i transpose this x to numerator it will become minus the exponent sign will get changed okay so it will become x to the power minus one using power function rule this minus one will become the coefficient so we have x then minus one and this exponent is subtracted by one so we have actually minus x to the power minus two and it can be written as minus one upon x square okay this is our power function rule here now let me wrap, wrap this out also so the derivative of one of one upon x that is 100 the derivative of x will be minus 1 upon x square as i have shown you here the derivative of constant is uh, 0 and the derivative of x is here 1 so we are left with this very thing okay so this is the slope of our average cost now next what we need to do we need to find the marginal cost what is marginal cost is simply the derivative of cost function with respect to x so what is our cost function is given us derivative of constant is 0 derivative of x is 1 so we are left with 1 plus derivative of x square will be 2x so 2 into 2 is 4x so we get here 4x okay now what is our relationship let us write here we have marginal cost minus average cost now what is our marginal cost we have calculated this is 1 plus 4x to this we subtract average cost which is given us as 100 upon x uh, plus 1 plus 2x okay so this is 1 plus 4x minus 100 upon x minus 1 minus 2x okay so this 1 and 1 will get cancelled 4x uh, first write uh, 100 upon x we will write this now 4x minus 2x comes out to be 2x so this is mc minus ac okay now what is a one how one upon x mc minus ac so let's multiply by one upon x here also so we will get minus 100 upon x plus 2x okay so this is here minus 100 upon this x is multiplied to each term here so this is x square plus we have 2x upon x this x and x gets cancelled we are left with minus 100 upon x square plus 2 okay so what was our so the slope of average cost was this we got here this very term and also here we got this very very relationship that is 1 upon x mc minus ac here we can see uh, this rhs is same 
RHS is same in both the cases. When RHS is same in the both cases, we can equate the LHS. That means uh, slope slope of AC is equal to this very thing. 1 upon X MC minus AC. Okay, let me write it here. Let us say we have uh, if X is equal to 4, Y is also equal to 4. Since RHS is same, we can write x is equal to y. I am just using this very relationship because since this very thing is equal to this uh, uh, expression, this very thing is also equal to this very expression. Both the expressions on RHS are same. We can equate the LHS here. Okay. I hope I make myself clear in this video. Thank you.